Keep calm and pray the Psalms. For May the 9th, 2024, Thursday, the ascension of our Lord, 40 days after the resurrection of our Lord, the, we, we celebrate the ascension. And this is, of course, being uh, video recorded uh, earlier in the day when you see this I will be gathering with the rest of, of my brothers and sisters in the Fourth Circuit of the New England District. We are gathering down at Good Shepherd Lutheran Church in Suffield, Connecticut. Pastor Adam Moore being the pastor down there. And we are this night uh, celebrating the ascension of our Lord. And so for the psalm prayer tonight, we will use the prayers for the ascension of our Lord. One of the points of ceremony for the ascension of our Lord is that the Paschal candle back there uh, is extinguished during the reading of the gospel. I will keep it lit uh, for our prayers, and you'll see that tomorrow on Friday uh, we won't light it from this time forth until the, well, the end of, end of Easter, until we need it again. But we can still say, Christ is risen, alleluia. He is risen indeed, alleluia. This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it the rising of the sun to its setting. The name of the Lord is to be praised. Using the introductory psalm for the ascension of our Lord, at Psalm 110, verses 1, 4, and 5, the antiphon comes from Psalm 47, verse 5. God has gone up with a shout, the Lord with the sound of a trumpet. The Lord says to my Lord, sit at my right hand until I make your enemies your footstool. The Lord has sworn and will not change his mind. You are a priest forever after the order of Melchizedek. The Lord is at your right hand. He will scatter kings on the day of his wrath. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. God has gone up with a shout. The Lord has Lord with the sound of a trumpet. We speak the Catechism. We shall have no other gods. You shall not misuse the name of the Lord your God. Remember the Sabbath day by keeping it holy. Honor your father and your mother. You shall not murder. You shall not commit adultery. You shall not steal. You shall not give false testimony against your neighbor. You shall not covet your neighbor's house. You shall not covet your neighbor's wife or his manservant or maidservant, his ox or donkey, or anything that belongs to your neighbor. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead, he ascended into heaven and sits at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From thence he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Christian Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. 
Forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. Almighty God, as your only begotten Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, ascended into heaven, so may we also ascend in heart and mind and continually dwell with him there, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Luther's Evening Prayer. I thank you, my Heavenly Father, through Jesus Christ, your dear Son, that you have graciously kept me this day. And I pray that you would forgive me all my sins where I have done wrong, and graciously keep me this night. For into your hands I commend myself, my body and soul and all things. Let your holy angel be with me, that the evil foe may have no power over me. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord bless thee and keep thee. The Lord make his face to shine upon thee and be gracious unto thee. The Lord lift up his countenance upon thee and give thee peace. Amen. Christ is risen, alleluia. He is risen indeed, alleluia. Remember us tonight, remember in your prayers tonight that Jesus fills all things, that he has overcome death for you, and then he has placed you within himself so that you also overcome death. You have a good night.